Hey guys, Phantom Fixer here with you again. This time showing off something for War Machine and Hordes. I only actually play War Machine stuff. I haven't really gotten into Hordes, but it's for both, I guess. But anyway, this is it. This is a box I made. And I just thought it might appeal to some folks to make one of these. They're really, really cheap. All this is is a box from Michaels. And all I did was go around and printed out a suitable image for the top of it, which I then decoupaged onto the top of that. If you don't know how to do that, you just take Mod Podge, you put it on there after you've painted it, stick your image down, and then coat it with a few more coats of the Mod Podge to seal it down. And it, you know, looks suitable. Got some skull and crossbones, uh, you know, just cheap little things that you get at any art store. These are the uh, corner edgings. You can get those at Michael's or Hobby Lobby. Same thing with the little uh, closing brackets here. You can get those Michael's Hobby Lobby, that sort of thing. And then in here, I have my tray with all my Crix tokens. I actually made the mistake of getting two of these sets once a while back and once recently, but keep them all separated. Easy to use during the game. And then all my other stuff, you know, the templates and something to write on my spells and measuring sticks and cards everything you need for a game just right here so it's kind of handy to have super easy to build i mean the box costs you about 10 15 bucks if you have a coupon you spray paint it whatever color you want or brush paint it however you want to do it and you just put a tray together this is all just foam core that's glued together to make you know it fits in use balsa to make legs so that it stands up but uh you just take foam core, glue it down to the other foam core to make the, what's his name? You can see the little holes in here, maybe. But I use pins to hold everything in place until all the Elmer's glue dry. And then just shot it with green paint, you know, because Crix is all about being green. It's not easy being green. So anyway, that's just my little game box for War Machines, hordes. Thought I'd show it off. Super easy to make. Um, I'm probably going to do one for 40K. I know I'm going to do one for Drop Zone Command. I already have the box. I just have to get to painting it. So, uh, one of the other things I was going to talk about a moment ago, I put some of this, uh, you know, the really easy going foam on the bottom of this. So I can also use it as a dice rolling box if I have to. I just chuck the dice in there and they'll roll around, but they won't make quite the racket. So, anyway, that's uh, just something built probably 20, 30 bucks and about five, six hours worth of work over a couple of days to let everything, you know, paint and dry and all that other good stuff. So just maybe spark an idea or a thought in somebody else and build one of your own or do something better. God knows it shouldn't be hard. So anyway, guys, take care. Talk to you later. Be good.